Hey, First Baptist family, this is uh, your pastor, Dale Baker here, and I uh, just wanted to make a short video about how to download the uh, app Zoom. And so that's going to be helpful because I know we're social distancing and we're apart and we're away from everybody. And so I thought, what a great way. Maybe next week we have a couple prayer meetings. Uh, the, the passage that I've been reading, the passage that keeps coming to mind is Philippians chapter 4, verses 4 through 7. And it says this, it says, Rejoice in the Lord always. I say again, rejoice. Let your graciousness be known to everyone. The Lord is near. Right? This is good news. This is a promise for us uh, to hold on to. And it says this in verse 6. I don't worry about anything, but in everything through prayer and petition with thanksgiving, present your request to God. And the peace of God, which surpasses all understanding, will guard your heart and minds in Christ Jesus. And so if, if I'm going to keep reading that, and I'm going to keep saying that, that thing that keeps coming to mind, I think it'd be great if we could do some Zoom calls uh, together and we can have some prayer meetings. And so it's a, a simple way to do it. And so I'm going to walk you through it right now. And hopefully uh, you can stop and pause the video. If, you, if I go too fast, just stop it, do the step, and then start the video back over. And you can watch it as many times as you would need. And so the first thing you want to do is you want to get to your home page on your app store here. And so uh, you want to find uh, your app store or your Google Play for Android. And then you come up to this menu and then down here is uh, a search. Let me get this a little closer. You can search here. You want to search. And up in the bar, up here, tap and then tap in the word Zoom, Z-O-O-M, and then hit search. And you'll see this Zoom cloud meeting, and that's what we need to get. And so that's what you'll need to get, and click get, or sometimes they'll say download, and then it asks me, do you want to install? Yeah, I want to install. Then you'll need to know your Apple ID if you have an Apple uh, or your password to type in. And so I know my password. You want to type it in. And click sign in. All right, done. And it begins to download. Oh, it's asking me if I want to save my password. This is the first time I use this one. So it's downloading. It's taking time uh, to download. Okay. All right. So uh, it's downloaded. And now in the App Store, you want to click Open. And this is the page. And so there's several options here. You can join a meeting, which you don't want to do. There's Sign Up or Sign In. You want to, if you don't have a Zoom account, which I'm guessing most of you don't, you want to sign up. You'll put your email address in. Uh, mine is FBC Pastor Dale at gmail.com. You want to type in your first name and your last name, and you want to agree to the terms. Then you want to click over here on the right, sign up, and say OK. Now what you're going to do is you're going to wait for an email to that email account you have signed up to. And so we'll wait and we'll wait and we'll wait for that email. And so I have my email over here opened and ready to go. All right, so you'll get an email and you'll go to that email and it'll say Zoom. And it'll say, please activate your Zoom account. Click on that, and then you hear here, you want to see the big blue button, activate account. Then it's going to ask you, it says, welcome to Zoom. Hi, Dale Baker. Your account has been sex successfully created. Please list your name and create a password online. So that's what you'll do. You'll create a password uh, online. No, no, don't. And then click continue. Uh, I 
to save the password and then you want to go back to your device All right, so you get back to, after you've activated your account, you get back to this page, and you'll click sign in. There's the email that I created with. And there you go. You're ready to do the Zoom account, and we're ready to have a prayer meeting with our church family. And so... Uh, Go through that, watch the video again. If you have any questions or you're, you're stuck, give me a call and I would be more than happy to walk you through it. Know that we are praying for you and we love you and we'll, we'll hopefully talk to you soon. God bless.